Hello, welcome to the Okta support playlist. Today we'll be talking about how to enable Okta Verify push notifications and the setup required to automatically send the notification to the end user's mobile device. First, we'll need to ensure that the option is enabled in the Okta admin console. We'll do this by navigating to Security, Authenticators, and here on the Setup tab, we'll locate the line for Okta Verify and select Actions, Edit. On the Okta Verify settings page, locate the section titled Verification Options and ensure the option for push notification, Android and iOS only is enabled with a blue check mark. Once that is enabled, scroll to the bottom and select Save. Now, if you have not yet upgraded to Okta Identity Engine or OIE, then the labels for some of these menu options will appear differently. On Classic, you'll navigate to Security, Multi-Factor, and then on the Factor Types tab, locate and ensure Okta Verify is selected then you'll find the section labeled Okta Verify Settings. If the checkbox next to Enable Push Notifications is not already checked, go ahead and click the Edit button, enable the setting, and scroll to the bottom and click Save. Now that we know that push notification is enabled for the environment, we can proceed with the steps that each end user will need to complete in order for the push notification to be sent automatically each time a request for Okta Verify is required. After signing into your environment, users that require Okta Verify will see this page. By checking the box labeled Send Push Automatically, the user will not have to push the Send Push button each time they are presented with this page. Instead, the button will read Push Notification Sent, and the user will see a prompt on their Okta Verify device immediately after seeing this page. Thanks for watching. For more Okta support videos, check out the Octa support playlist.